Boogeyman Ben. Hey everyone, it's Boogeyman Ben. Hope everyone's doing well and everyone had a great day. Um, just wanted to do a real quick video, um, talk about something I just read. It actually was published this morning, but uh, I was really busy at work, so I didn't have a chance to read it until today, uh, later this afternoon. But it looks like Beverly Hills Cop 4 has been pulled from Paramount's uh, release date of March the 25th of 2016, which put, a, put it right up against uh, Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice. Um, but this movie was announced back in 2013, and I did a retrospective on the Beverly Hills Cop series, um, and uh, was really looking forward to um, Eddie Murphy coming back and playing Axel Foley. Uh, I've said in you know that video that it's my favorite character he's played. It's my one of my favorite uh, series of all time. Uh, even though Beverly Hills Cop 3 isn't that great, I mean, I still enjoyed it. And what prompted them to even announce and do a Beverly Hills Cop 4, you know, that they were going to do one is because... Um, the the TV series, the planned pilot, they did a pilot for a television series that was going to feature Axel Foley's son, Aaron Foley, and uh, people just wanted, Ed, Eddie Murphy actually reprised his role as Axel Foley in it, just for a few um, scenes, and people really were happy to see him, and they just wanted to see him play this character again, so then the movie got announced, but then I kept hearing rumors that there were script problems, that Eddie Murphy wasn't happy with the scripts, and he wasn't going to do a shitty movie just to make some money. And so they keep get saying they can't get the script right, and I don't understand why they can't get the script right. I mean, but again, you know, I have no idea what it takes to make these films, but I am pretty much going to say that I doubt this movie will ever happen. Um, it's kind of like uh, Ghostbusters 3. I mean, they talked about a Ghostbusters 3 way before Harold Ramis had passed away. I think they started working on it in 2007, and every year I kept saying, "Oh, it's gonna." They were kept saying, uh, "Dan Aykroyd was saying, oh yeah, it's gonna go into production this summer or next year," and, and it never happened. And Bill Murray then bowed out of it, and it just. I think that as much as it pains me to say this, because I always wanted to see Eddie play this character again, I don't think it's gonna happen. I think what Paramount's gonna do is they're gonna go the Ghostbusters route and probably reboot it now. Now that he's, you know, that this movie's not coming out. And I hope that doesn't happen, but I'm thinking it's probably going to. And, uh, you know, I think the Ghostbusters uh, reboot with, uh, you know, an all-female cast. And you got, you know, Kristen Wiig and um, you got uh, Melissa McCarthy. Um, I, I think they got a great cast for that movie. Um, but, you know, I really don't want anybody else to play Axel Foley but Eddie Murphy. But, you know, again, it's been 20, 21 years since the third film, and I really am kind of not holding my breath that we're going to see him play this character again. So I just wanted to do a video real quick, kind of a bummer, but I'm curious what everybody else thinks. Uh, leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about this. I know it's not horror related, but you know, I did a retrospective on the series and said it was one of my favorite film series of all time. So I thought it was only fair that I, you know, talk about the fact that the announcement came out today. Beverly Hills Cop 4 is not coming out next March. So Kind of a bummer, but uh, just wanted to do this real quick. Hope everyone's doing well, and stay tuned for more videos, horror videos, for, coming very thanks soon. Thanks so much for watching, and hope everyone's doing well. Take it easy. Peace.